So I think we can all say it's been a very eventful few months since the novel coronavirus has come to the United States. Um, personally, I've not been attacked for it. However, I can say I did hear a conspiracy theory in my school that believed that the coronavirus was developed in a lab in Wuhan and dropped in Wuhan because of its proximity to Hong Kong. And so it, there was hopes it was spread there to quell the democratic protests of which there are no claims of that happening. However, that does not stop people from actually believing it. There is an evident rise in Asian American attacks, su such as people being verbally abused in the streets. There are stories of families getting attacked in the streets. There are also like, and people say, go back to your nation. Why have you done this? And workers in Asian, Asian American workers are also affected, such as healthcare workers, since some of their patients don't want their services because they believe the healthcare workers will give the patients the novel coronavirus, and also restaurants, specifically serving Asian food, because people believe that though that they will contract the coronavirus somehow through the food because it was made by Asian hands. And so a lot of this culminated in some reactions. And in my opinion, you don't have to, first of all, justify your existence as Asian or as an Asian American. You can just be you. You are human. You don't, none of us deserve this. And we sh and words do have power. We can see how Donald Trump used his words to call it the, the Chinese virus and Mike Pompeo calling it the Wuhan virus, giving it the association to us Asian Americans. But we can fight back with our own words. Just remember that.